Hello everyone, so today I am solving a stick length problem from searching and sorting of PSES problem set. So here the problem is there are n sticks with uh, some length and uh, our task is to modify the stick so that each stick has same length. So we can either lengthen or shorten each stick and uh, both operation means lengthen cost x whereas shorten also cost x which is uh, the difference from original length what is the minimum total cost here the input provided will be the first line of input will be the total number of sticks in the example case it is 5 and uh, there are n integers p1 to pn the length of sticks in second line we will be given the input with the length of all sticks so what we have to do is we have to change the size of each sticks such that all of them are of equal size uh, uh, let us say we want to make a uh, length of all sticks 3 then to make this uh, 2 3 we have to add 1 here we have to add 0 here we have to add 2 here we have to subtract 2 here and uh, we have to add 1 here <coughs> So the total cost will be 1 plus 0 plus 2 plus 2 plus 1. So it is <coughs> 6 in total. Uh, in the case, uh, let us first understand the approach we will be using. stick length okay let us say we have four sticks uh, with length four six two and three okay so what we will do in this case is uh, in uh, both the case uh, with even number of input and odd number of input uh, let us also take example of odd number of input it will be two three five six uh, two and uh, one okay it is from the demo example so here what basically we are going to do is first of all we will short the list so here the sorted list will be okay the sorted list will be 2 3 4 6 and here the sorted list will be 1 2 2 3 5 now when we have even number of input then we will add we will first find the middle of the list here the middle is uh, 2 so now we will subtract addition of the numbers after the middle point and summation of numbers before the middle point uh, for example here the number is 4 6 so 4 plus 6 4 plus 6 minus 2 plus 3 so here we will get our answer which is uh, 4 plus 6 10 minus 5 is 5 will be our answer uh, in second case uh, what we will do is uh, here we are not having equal number of uh, sticks on both the sides of middle term so we will skip the middle term so here we will add a 3 5 and subtract 1 2 from it so it will be 3 plus 5 minus 1 plus 2 so the answer will be 5 ok we can confirm the answer for this uh, demo example from our CSES website the same input and output is 5 so we can say that our formula will work so let us take the input for input the first input will be n which will be total number of uh, elements in list so for that we will uh, take an integer input and the second input will be the list so for that we will make a loop inside the list which is for int i for i in input dot split so here we are done with our input now we will 
uh, sort our list so ls dot sort our list is sorted okay so next thing we are gonna do is uh, we are gonna find answer which will be sum of last two terms so for sum of last two term we will need middle term so mid will be uh, n divided by 2 and for this sum uh, ls of ls of mid plus n modulo 2 okay so here what n modulo 2 will do is if uh, we will have a list with a even number of integer then n modulo 2 will be 0 and if we will have list with odd number of integers then n modulo 2 will be 1 so it will help us skip the middle element if the list is having odd number of elements minus sum of and at last we will print our answer let us run this 5 2 3 1 5 two. here we have our answer 5 okay let us submit this code Take length submit. So here our code is accepted. Thanks for watching the video.